dropping off and I noticed like real crime scene tape on the door with biohazard stickers that the police use. How's it going shoppers? Today we're going to be doing a little bit of Walmart Spark and maybe some Instacart. Instacart kindly sent me another hat and I love this one. It's perfect for the cold weather that we're having right now. It's currently like 40, 50 degrees, which is pretty cold for a Texan. Anyways, I have a really small goal of only $50 today. We're just going to be seeing if we can uh, pay for everything that I need to buy for myself today. I already needed to come to Walmart to do some Christmas shopping. So if I could do a few orders and have them pay for my groceries, I'm going to be pretty happy. Anyways, I'll see you guys whenever we get our first order. All right, so we just finished our shopping. I was in Walmart, didn't see one spark order, which I thought was weird. I bought some Christmas lights and I only spent $36, so that's not too bad. Less than my goal for today. While I was in there, I got a $52 Instacart order. So it's a three person order. It's gonna take two carts and we're gonna go do that right now. Just doing that is gonna pay for everything that I did for like fun today, since my other hobby has already paid me plenty for today. So anyways, I'll see you guys at the store, hopefully with a cart full of stuff fairly soon, but uh, I'm not looking forward to hauling this order around. It's massive. All right, so it took us 45 minutes to shop and it was heavy. It was very difficult to shop with two carts, but right now I'm gonna double check the order, at least one of them. And uh, man, I'm getting tired. Glad I'm only doing one order today, but this one's definitely worth it. It's gonna be dropping off closer to my house, but for whatever reason, the closest person to the store is not first on the delivery. So that's slightly annoying, but I think uh, they'll survive. So the last drop off was a business, so I couldn't record it, but that cart back there saved me. I don't know if you guys could even see it, but I think uh, Gig Life was telling me that I needed to uh, throw it back in the car because uh, my back's gonna be hurting in a few years if I don't. So I'm listening to him and uh, it's definitely worth having in here, especially now that I'm not doing Costco anymore. Like I'm not needing every square inch of my car with these orders. Right now I'm heading towards an apartment and this is for the small order, so nothing heavy to take up the stairs. It'll just be done in one trip. But it may be cold outside, but I definitely worked up a sweat doing this order. It was a lot of heavy lifting and honestly quite the workout, especially when I do this apartment order. All right, guys, we just dropped off the last customer's order. We made 52 bucks in about, I think, uh, hour and a half, hour, 45 minutes. So pretty good hourly rate. Did barely any driving driving that I was gonna do today anyways to go get some groceries. So last drop off was a little interesting. Hopefully everything's okay, but uh, I was dropping off and I noticed like real crime scene tape on the door with biohazard stickers that the police use. So the door was sealed and you could tell that it was recently cut open, but it was not a Halloween decoration. It was legit and uh, the guy he was coming back to the door while I was dropping off. I don't know, hopefully uh, everything's okay, but I don't know what has to happen for that to occur. I don't know if someone died or I don't know. That was just a, a weird drop off. Not the weirdest one though. I've had definitely weirder stuff happen. Anyways, thank you guys for uh, watching this random ride along video. I know it was pretty short, but the truth is right now I am doing a lot of work on Amazon influencers because this is the, the best quarter for us. So I gotta make my money and do what pays me the most. And right now Amazon's paying me the most, but I still go out every once in a while to just do little errands like this. And I'll make sure to still be recording. The channel's not done for, unless if Instacart copyright strikes us. But other than that, we're gonna keep pushing. We're just not pushing quite as hard as we used to on YouTube. Anyways, that's it. I'm done rambling. 
Thank you guys for watching. Have a good one.